Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new here, I'm Hayley and a huge welcome and I hope you guys will stick around. I have a lot of non-toxic DIY recipes on here. I do low-tox cleaning videos, um, a little bit of day in the life vlogs and mummy style stuff on here so if you guys like that kind of content I hope that you guys will consider hitting the subscribe button and hanging out with me a little bit longer so today I'm doing a bit of a sit down video um, I put up on my Instagram last week um, a scan that I did using my iTrovi scanner and I had heaps of questions um, on there regarding what it was, what it did, and how it worked. So I thought I would do a video on it so that it covers a wide range of your questions and hope that it will teach you guys something in the meantime. So one of the most asked questions I got with this little machine was, what the heck is that? <laughs> so I'm here to answer that question right here for you. So this is an iTobi scanner. It has a metal plate here and here and those need to touch your skin when you use it and it sends a little vibration throughout your body which then can read what your body is frequencing at. Now I'm pretty sure frequencing isn't a word so <laughs> it reads the frequency that our body is putting out and if you guys don't know already our body runs at a frequency every emotion is a frequency every hormone is a frequency and all that kind of stuff and obviously food and water run at their own frequency as well so what this little guy does it will put a vibration through your body and read the frequency and see where it dips or where it's lagging and then it helps us to know what to do to support our bodies to bring that balance back. So this scanner uses galvanic skin response. <laughs> yeah, that never made sense to me as well until I looked into it, so don't worry if you're like, what? <laughs> so in a nutshell, the iTobi helps us to understand our bodies a little bit deeper on an emotional level and on a physical level as well. So it measures the response from our body, so the frequency report that it's getting back, and it allows us to or it will list 10 essential oils for us to help in those areas because essential oils are plants and they also run at their own frequency. It's what plants do, it's what nature does, it's what humans do. So we work in the same way. So if we're using essential oils on our skin, it's going to help bring that frequency back up to a balance to keep us healthy. So the iTobi uses the same kind of technology as a Fitbit. Um, basically it's scanning your body and can feel the differences. So a Fitbit can read your pulse for example, so the iTobi is pretty much doing the same. It runs off temperature and any electrical charges throughout the skin um, and can read that and put a report in and that allows us to know which essential oils to use to help us. So if that still isn't making any sense, I will give you a tutorial and scan myself for you and show you how it works. So all you need is just to download the iTobi app. So also turning on your iTobi. Now it's important to note that the iTobi is not a diagnostic device, so don't take this over medical advice. This is just something you can do at home to confirm any suspicions that you may have and just helps you to understand what you can do at home. So from there, you hit scan. I already have my details in here, but you can put in your name and your age and if you're pregnant or not, and that will just help you um, get the reports that's more personalized for you. So I'm gonna hit mine. Now you can scan for a number of products. You can scan for three, five, seven, or 10. You can also do all of the products in your company. So I've chosen doTERRA. You can do Young Living and others if you like. It depends what essential oil company that you like to use. So you can scan for all products, just oils, supplements, just blends, 
or an aroma touch which is a certain blend that we have you can do just the home essentials kit which is the top 10 oils oh, but we are going to go just oils for today so then what we do from here is we want to make sure that these two metal plates are touching our skin so I like to hold it with my fingers on the plate and my thumb on the top. Then we hit start scan. Hi, I'm Cy Tidwell, one of the co-founders of Itobi. Did you know that all essential oils, supplements, vitamins and minerals have a unique frequency? Right now the scanner is sending out subtle electrical frequencies throughout your body, measuring and recording your body's response. This will give you an accurate reading for which oils and supplements that your body responds best to. Companies like Fitbit and Samsung are using the same GSR technology to give you accurate readings to improve your wellness. Simple things like temperature, stress, and fatigue will wear down your body. Using our own proprietary algorithm, a report is being generated which will help maximize your experience with the oils and supplements. The Itobi device is not a diagnostic tool, however, it does help in creating a wellness plan. In just a few seconds, you will receive a personalized report. We encourage you to use the oils and supplements to enhance your life. So these are my top 10 oils that will help my body bring back some balance. So it doesn't mean you have to go and get all of these and make a big diffuser blend. It breaks it down through your emotions and also your body systems. So, emotion wise, um, when you come up with the bigger blocks, that's what you really, really need support in, um, as opposed to ones with one block. So obviously I'm needing to feel a bit safe. I have been a little bit stressed out. We've got a lot going on in this house right now. <laughs> These oils here will bring me feelings of security, certainty, protection, and reliability. So clove, juniper berry, tea tree, also known as melaleuca, lavender, and celery seed oil. So I can use any of those in my diffuser. I can sit and breathe it from the bottle. I can make up a roller if I wanted to and use that. Um, it's really up to me in that point. So it goes for all of these. You just go through and figure out what you have in your collection um, or something with a similar property that you can use if you don't have that specific oil and it will help you to feel those feelings of positivity. So moving on to body systems, it's saying that my immune system needs some support. So oregano, Douglas fir, lemon, wild orange and lime. So in this case, I would probably make up a diffuser blend as well as use a roller with some stuff in there to support me as well. So before I choose my diffuser blend, I like to go through the essential life. Um, this is basically the essential oil Bible, um, but it gives you a deeper understanding of why the oils have come up. So it'll tell you what the oil properties are good for. Um, and can support you with. So I like to go in and choose something that resonates with me plus something I have in my collection. So I do that. And then emotional wise, I like to look through this book because it gives you a deeper understanding of your emotions and that will help you to connect with your oils more as well. Your time. 
How much longer will you suffer in this life? But don't give up, just hold on tight It'll be alright a minute or so of breathing in the diffuser oils um, I like to if I have peace and quiet which I do today I would usually write down in a journal and try to get those feelings out um, and just try to release them from my body this book is really really helpful um, for example let's go to what your Lang Ylang can do one of my favorite oils, Ylang Ylang. Ylang Ylang helps to bring out the inner child and that pretty much is bang on. It helps to bring out the positive properties and positive, positive emotions within yourself. So it allows you to feel more playful, free, intuitive, emotionally connected. It helps with emotional healing. It helps you to feel joyful, and innocent so um, it also tells you what you compare the oils to as well to give it a boost so it's saying you compare it with geranium tangerine wild orange rose or red mandarin and that will just help to get a better response from your body and your emotional systems um, so it helps to get rid of any negative emotions as well which is feeling joyless stressed overanalyzing, sad, disconnected from inner child. So that is just Ylang Ylang alone. Um, I've chosen lavender, citrus bliss and tea tree as well. So I thought that's gonna be a heavy hitter to help me provoke some joy and feel safe. It's also a really grounding blend as well and that's going to help me to feel really safe, um, emotionally held and just to feel calm so which is the complete opposite of how I'm feeling this week I really like to lean in on my oils when I'm feeling highly emotional or if there's any stress within my body so yeah that is pretty much what the Itovi does and how it works to help support you with your essential oils um, if you are using them if you're not using essential oils and you like the sound of this I have a wellness business this is what I do for my business. So if you guys are interested in that whatsoever, um, I have a link down below for my website. And I also am going to link my essential oil Instagram so you can go and have a look. But yeah, this is what I do for a job. It's my passion. I love it. And I use it every day, probably behind the scenes lately um, but I use oils every single day they have been such an impact on my life I've used them for over four years now we're going into the fifth year so yeah they've changed my life how I do things and how I react within my emotions and I just know how to support myself when things get tough maybe not initially I like to dwell or I don't like to but I always dwell in my feelings but when I come to I always press in and lean into my essential oils so if that's something you think you'd like to do we can definitely chat um, but I'm going to go and journal and just take some time for me while I have it so I hope you guys are having a beautiful day and I hope that this video brought you some information that you didn't know already and there goes the lighting <laughs> Um, they're trying to pour some concrete out the back at the moment as we speak. That will be an upcoming vlog as well. I know you guys are loving following the backyard renos, so hopefully I can bring that to you guys. If it doesn't rain, please don't rain. No stress. <laughs> okay, guys, so thanks for watching, and I will see you in my next video. Bye. I won't say goodbye yet. Can I change your mind?